I'm able to book five sales calls every single day for my business. And no, I don't run paid ads and I don't spend hours reaching out to people online. Instead, I follow a simple but proven strategy that makes it unreasonable for me not to book at least five calls at a bare minimum every single day. Now, in this video, I'm pulling up the curtain. I'm showing you exactly how I do my outreach to book this many sales calls on my calendar every single day. Now, I'm gonna be sharing my screen and walking you through step-by-step -step live how I set up my outreach campaigns to book this many sales calls every day. So by the end of this video, you're going to be booking three to five sales calls every day like clockwork. Here are the tools that you're going to need to start booking meetings. The first thing is, of course, lead data. You need the emails that you're going to be contacting doing that cold outreach. And ideally, you're using data that also has additional information like their job title, their website, their city, their location. This will all make our outreach more effective. I recommend using Instantly's Lead Finder for lead data that you know is going to be clean. And if you don't want to pay, you can do this manually using LinkedIn, you can go in and find people's contact information that you want to reach out to. The next thing that you're going to need to do is set up and warm sending emails. We don't recommend sending from your own domain. So you want to buy domains that are adjacent to your main domain. For example, if your company is otterlove.com, you're going to want to find domains that are similar to that. Otters love, otterloves.com, and then forward that domain to your existing domain. I recommend starting with about five domains and 10 sender accounts. Pick one name that you're going to send from, ideally your own. You're then going to want to warm these sending emails emails and you can do that right there on instantly all for free included in every package. The next thing and this is where people get it wrong. This is where this video is going to save your life and make you so much money is the copy and offer creation. I'm about to show you my template that you can pretty much copy and paste into whatever industry and whatever offer that you use. So the copy creation is very very important here and we'll be going over that in just a second. The next thing you're going to need is a good sending tool. Instantly.ai is the best in class sending tool and it's very easy to scale. Last but not least you want to make sure that they're actually converting to calls. So I'll be giving you some tips and tricks on how to make that happen. Here is my cold email template that you can copy and paste into your own business. For the purpose of this use case, I chose consultants as an industry that we're targeting. And for my offer, I chose lead generation services. Subject line, 14 consultants in city. So the city is a variable. So you replace that city with whatever city you're targeting. Let's say this is Tampa, 14 consultants in Tampa. This raises some curiosity and it gets them to open the email. It also needs to be relevant to the rest of the email. So for example, you can't say your house is on fire and then go and pitch them for some business topic. Moving on to the next step is the first line. So hello, name, simple personalization. It's Jay from YouTube. Hope things are good in Tampa. Again, reinforcing that city and it's Jay from YouTube makes them think like they already know me. Now remember when they looking at this email in their inbox, they're only going to see a couple of things. They're going to see your name, they're going to see your subject line, and they're going to see the first sentence of the email. Whatever those things are, need to pique their curiosity and get them to open that email. I came across your LinkedIn and I had to reach out. Most people have a LinkedIn and most people have an email address on LinkedIn. I've helped 14 other consultants in Tampa over the last six months book an additional five meetings per day. This sentence causes the reader, the recipient to think, oh wow, he's working with people in my location. He's had success with them and he's booking five meetings per day for them. I want that too. So if you want to know how, check out my YouTube channel below. This is social proof. What makes them trust you? This is your chance to get them to trust you. I was wondering, do you already have someone keeping your calendar full of qualified meetings. Now, the goal of this first email in the call to action is to get a reply, not to get them to click on a link and book a meeting. It's to get them to reply. And as humans, we are wired to want to answer questions. If they do, awesome. They'll say yes. If they don't, they can say no, but that doesn't mean they're, they're out of the ball game. You want to be as personal as possible, and you don't just want to lead with the calendar link. Finally, it's important to note that there are some rules to cold email. So I put address and unsubscribe link here because you should include your business address and an unsubscribe link in every single cold email so that you don't violate can spam rules. Now just running through what that would look like on instantly. I've got a test workspace here and in the top left, you'll see lead finder. This is where you're gonna pull your leads from. You can filter here by location industry. I recommend that you use industry and location and make sure that you're not targeting people that are too big. For example, Fortune 500 CEOs when you're just starting, you're probably not gonna get in touch with those people. Then you're gonna move these contacts into a email sequence here in campaigns. Now, some little tricks within campaigns that are going to help bolster your results are within sequence, you can come in here and create different variants. Now, a lot of the time we might think we know what people are going to respond best to, but it's good to create small variations, especially in the subject lines and first lines to see which ones get opened more and read more. The next thing to note is that you can create multiple steps in your sequence. You don't just want to reach out once and then stop. You want to reach out multiple times. I recommend at least three touch points in a sequence before you give up on somebody. The way that 
that I typically frame this is I wait two days and then I wait five days. If they don't answer by the third email, I'm gonna move on to the next person so that I can reach out to more people. If you have an audience with limited numbers of contacts to reach out to, for example, if you only wanna reach out to hedge fund managers in Idaho, there might only be 12 of them. They're probably not a good example to put in a three series drip sequence, probably reach out to those people personally. But for example, if there's a thousand people total, you might wanna make that drip sequence seven or nine steps instead of just three. Last but not least, it's really important to not start cold emailing until you have warm inboxes. As you can see these health scores on the right are all above 98%. These have all been warming for several weeks and are now fully capable of sending cold emails. If you start sending cold emails from sending accounts that are not fully warm, your emails will go to spam and your campaigns will not last very long. So make sure to give them at least two to four weeks at 50 emails per day. Make sure to use the smart settings that are located right here. So once you set these up, increase I do by two each day until it reaches 50. And then I keep reply rate at 30. And there you have it. Here are the analytics to one of my campaigns here. I've got 8.2% reply rates. The open rate is skewed because as you can see, I decided disabled open tracking, which is an advanced thing that I would not recommend you do starting off. But this is how you generate appointments on autopilot. 158 people replied out of 2000 contacts that I made. Most of these were positive. Now those are really great numbers. And if you translate that into your own business, you're going to be booking three to five meetings per day, very fast and on autopilot. Now remember, when you get a positive reply to your cold email sequence, get to it quickly. Speed to lead closes the deal. Someone responds and they're interested in what you have to offer. Reply to them fast. Give them a call and get them booked on your calendar so that you can explain the offer in more detail. All right, so now you have all of the tools that you need to go start booking three to five meetings per day. Now you just need the tools to do it. Go to instantly.ai, get signed up for a free trial and start scheduling leads for yourself today. Now, if you want to go deeper on any of the topics that I just covered, or you want in-depth guides, just click here and we will show you everything from setting up cold email to writing cold email scripts to finding great lead data. All of it is available at your fingertips. Just go ahead and click, watch those videos, get signed up for instantly.ai and I'll see you in the next video.